Jason JV on YouTube. He's the guy that did the F Gonna Give It To You song, and you need to check him out. So subscribe, tap the little bell, turn on the notifications, and if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it, yeah! Uh, what's up with you, Jason JV? Give me a shout, man, and just sending love, peace, and blessings to you. Thank you for being such a long-time fan. You gotta keep going. I gotta keep going. Much love to you, JV. Chris Calico. Cali, baby! Oh! <laughs> what? Were you expecting somebody else? Wrong. -o. Yo, what's good, guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another review video. And yes, no, that was not a botch um, for this next reaction. And actually, before we get to this, man, I gotta give a few shout outs uh, to some people. You know what I'm saying? Um, first off, I gotta give a shout out to Angela Sanchez. Uh, appreciate the requested reactions i did get your next request and i will be hitting that up as soon as possible uh, appreciate you you know always supporting uh always showing love and uh yeah and then uh i gotta give a shout out to my man jay from the redneck Rivera. always showing love as well and uh you know whether it's on my reactions or behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I appreciate you, Jay. And then, of course, Elena G. I also got to give a shout-out to uh, whenever I would post uh, my videos on Twitter, she would always uh, retweet my videos. She would always heart my videos and then share them out to everybody. So, yeah, appreciate that love. We just hit, guys, we just hit 57, 50 family members. 5,750 family members. We are halfway to 5,800, man. Whew. <laughs> and yeah, man, I just I just can't thank you guys enough, you know, for all the love and all the uh, support. And um, yeah. And um, also, I want to thank Elena G while we're at it um, for helping me feel welcome uh, when hanging out on Jackson Pierce's live. Shout out to my man, Jackson Pierce. For as you guys know, from the title down below, uh, we are having a look at one of JP's songs. Uh, this is a song that I did get a little, you know, a little preview of, if if you will, on uh, a few separate occasions. Um, now, to be fair, I did listen to this through my phone without headphones, so I'll, this will be the first time I'm going to get the full experience of this song. But I don't want to use it as an excuse to call this a reaction, because technically I have heard the song, you know, um... So yeah, but this, however, will be the first full experience with it. And uh, as you guys know, I'm not a stranger to uh, JP's music. As you guys know, I'm I'm homies with Alpha Tyler. Shout out to the homie Alpha Tyler. You know what I'm saying? Alpha Team Fam all day, every day, representing, you know what I'm saying? And uh, on many occasions, on Tyler's ATRL streams, which airs every Thursday nights, you know what I'm saying? Around around 9, yeah, 9 p.m., if memory properly serves make sure y'all go and subscribe to alpha tyler if you're not already and check out his atrl streams every thursday nights you know what i'm saying and uh you know re feel free to get your request in you know what i mean uh show my man some things some things you know what i mean that maybe he may not have ever heard before that y'all are into whether it's original music from yourselves or if there's an artist that he may not have heard of before feel free to get those requests in Again, shout out to my man Alpha Tyler. And also, shout out to my man uh, Matt Hatter Reacts for he too has also played um, Jackson Pierce's um, music. Jackson Pierce's music. I want to make sure I say the name right. I don't want to disrespect my man. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, Hatter on his streams has also played uh, JP's music. As a matter of fact, Hatter wrote a diss track a while back that um, JP performed for him. Um, that you can find on his channel, uh, him being uh, Jackson Pierce, you know what I'm saying, who uh, recorded the diss track uh, many moons ago, um, and I believe that was the only one he made, or no, there was another one, but anyway, it was an old thing, it's no longer a thing anymore as far as I know, just so you guys are all caught up, up to speed, you know what I'm saying, and uh, yeah, and I can't wait, man, to finally review one of JP's songs, this one being called not my fault and uh apparently this is gonna be a lyric video 
Um, and this is going to be from his, um, I guess this is his upcoming LP simply called Level Headed, which I am excited for. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this, shall we? Once again, Jackson Pierce, not my fault. Lyric video from his Level Headed LP. Without further ado, like the hit hit. I gotta say already, right off the rip, man, I love this visual right here. You got the ninja right here, you know what I mean? Just posting up on top of this post, pillar, whatever you want to call it. You got the rain and the lightning going on, you know what I'm saying? Bro, let's go. Everywhere I look around me, it feels like everybody's drowning. I don't see any life rafts. Many places don't seem fully staffed. So what's up with that? What's going on? What's happening? Sounds like my man is uh, talking about some people being caught up with what's going on in the world and everything. You know what I'm saying? Rather than, um, you know, getting themselves together, looking at themselves and getting themselves straight. You know what I'm saying? Bro. So what's up with that? What's going on? What's happening? I heard the Fresh Prince was a slapper. What? I heard. He said I heard the Fresh Prince was was a slapper. Uh, of course, that's a reference to, you know, the Oscars, the event at the Oscars where Will Smith slapped Chris Rock and that whole thing. Look, I already made, gave my opinions on that. Uh, as a matter of fact, I did a, I believe I did a, um, a reaction to Will Smith's apology video that you can't find on the channel. Uh, long story short, I basically said, hey, look, as far as that goes, I think Smith was in the wrong with how he handled things. I think he should have had a conversation with Chris. Uh, Chris Rock, you know what I mean, behind the scenes to explain his wife's condition because as we all know the only reason Chris Rock got slapped was because um, he made a joke about Jada Pinkett, you know, her hair situation. Um, yeah, I think Will Smith should have been a grown man about it, had a conversation with dude behind, behind the scenes because who knows, maybe Chris didn't know about Jada's condition. I mean, obviously the man is a professional comedian. I mean, my man is busy. You know what I mean? You think he got time to be going going on social media and looking at everything that, that's going on with people on social media? I don't think so. But anyway. Herbie lost Danny Tanner. Yeah, that's true. Bob Saget, he passed away, I believe, last year. It was him and, um, oh, man, I can't believe um Betty White, the, the last of the Golden Girls, if you will. She also passed away the same year, man. Somehow I'm a motherfucking rapper. Let's go. And it's not my fault. What's going on in the world today? Bro, I gotta say, man, this beat is slapping, and I love this hook, man. This hook is so silky smooth. Let's go. And it's not my fault. The people identify as them or they. The? And it's not my fault. Amber Turd likes a shit on Johnny's bed. <laughs> we all know that situation, right? With Johnny Depp and uh, Amber Turd. Right. And it's not my fault. Britney Spears looks like she's a fucking rat. Yeah, of course, addressing the whole uh, Britney Spears, um, uh, what is it, uh, the uh, consortium uh, situation there. What a mess that was. How's everybody going about their business? Repeat since stealing Kanye's bitch, Travis Scott. Damn, man. Damn. Damn, JP. And what a time to put this out, man. Right around the time where Ye done said some, some dumb shit on Alex Jones's uh, show and everything, man, which I'm not really going to get into, man, because that, eesh. Ugh. Man. What, what what a letdown, yay. I'm not going to play, man. What what a, what a letdown, man. Why did you go and say some dumb shit like that, man? Come on now. I keeps continuing the show. People in the big trampled on a little more. Sean Watson coming back. Playing for the Browns. They're paying in millions for all the charge counts. Then we got Netflix charging double four accounts. Human race just keeps adding more pronouns. And it's not my Bruh, he done hit a lot right there. Talking about, of course, the uh, deaths at Travis Scott's... Uh, concerts and yeah netflix raising their prices which thank god i don't have a netflix account anymore um yeah well that's part of it and then there's other reasons too that i really don't want to get into um then what else he, he said a lot 
human race keeps adding more pronouns. You know what I mean? This woke society that's being forced upon us, man. Bruh. It's not my fault. What's going on in the world today? And it's not my fault. Yelling against the full of subway. I like the little play on words right here. A gallon of gas is a foot long from Subway. I mean, he ain't wrong, man. Gas prices, especially here in California, redonkulous. Bruh. Subway, and it's not my fault. Elon Musk trying to become a Twitter head. And it's not. So at the time, uh, given with the lyrics in regards to Elon and Twitter, um, as JP said, you know, Elon's about to be a Twitter head at the time of this recording as of now, which is December the 10th, 2022. Elon Musk is officially the owner of Twitter. Uh, notice how I left out the word proud because, I mean, he's having some issues with, with uh, Twitter, with bot accounts and um, some other things that I can get, you know, too deep into. But anyway. I feel like the world that we're living in is getting more fucked up. Makes me want to kill again. First we So I like what you said right there. I feel like the world that we're living in is even more fucked up and it's continuing continuing to get more fucked up, which is true. So it makes me want to kill again. Meaning, you know, kind of makes him want to leave, you know, this part of the world and go to like a deserted island somewhere you know what i'm saying gilligan's island makes me want to gilligan gilligan's island escape to a private island away from all the noise away from all the nonsense hey i feel that man for real let's go you got the pandemic freaking havoc school still getting shot up causing panic if you ask me the is erratic yep so having uh school shootings and then let's see here still getting shot up causing panic if you ask me the is erratic deliberate so the media is erratic, celebrity, what? Be phonetic over here and static. Feeling like I can't even breathe, maybe I'm asthmatic. Maybe I got the virus, never know what's in the store. It's problematic, what the fuck am I hearing sirens for? When I was younger, I was pretty good at basketball. My downfall was at my height, I wasn't really tall. I knew I could have just... You know what that reminds me of? When he says that, you know, I was really good at basketball... But uh, I couldn't be accepted because my height, I wasn't really tall. It reminds me of, and it's funny because I just had a conversation uh, with uh, Desiree who hangs out, of course, on, on Alpha Tyler's stream. That's usually where, where I see her. Um, she also hangs out in the Discord and whatnot. Shout out to you, Desiree. Uh, we were, <laughs> it's funny because uh, Tyler was doing this, this gaming stream uh, with a couple other homies, you know what I'm saying? And, me, and we were throwing them off because me and Des, we were just naming songs, right? We were just going back and forth with, like, song titles and stuff. You had to be there in order to get the full context of what was happening. <laughs> and one of the songs I brought up was Skilo's song, I Wish. Now, see, some of you, you may, you may not recognize it because of the artist's name and the title of the song. He is a one-hit wonder, unfortunately. Um, but if I were to sing it and why it's relevant to what JP just said about his height and basketball, um, that hook, I believe it goes, I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a baller. I wish I had a girl who was a friend. I would call her. Wish I had a rabbit in a hat with a bat and a six form Paula. That's, that's why, that's why that song came into my head. Cause you know, basketball and I was very tall anyway. Let's change my name to Jacqueline, shoot a couple balls and see my teammates naked with you. What the fuck is this world coming to? When the woman swimming next to you is really a dude. Admit it. Whew, again, touch on, on another touchy subject. You know what I mean? What the... How do you, how did he say it? I don't want to mince words. So what the fuck is this world coming to? Is this world coming to? When the woman swimming next to you is really a dude. When the woman swimming next to you is really a dude. You know, yeah. I don't agree with the whole, you know, gender swapping just to, you know, in order to uh, participate in a division that biologically you should not be allowed in. But that's just me, though. Anyway. Admit it. It's weird. Admit it. You're queer. We all still know that you grow a fucking beard. That, that is true. That is true. You can, you know, turn yourself into a... 
into a woman. You can identify as a woman all you want, but you're 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 still that same person who can grow a beard. Bruh. It's not my fault. What's going on? In <laughs> I like that part of the room. It's not my fault. Reminds me of um Silk the Shockers, you know. Oh it ain't my fault. Did I do that? It ain't my fault. Did I do that? <laughs> Let's go. World today. It's not my fault. People identify as them or they again, touching on that whole, you know, woke society. I still can't believe that, man. That 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 shit that shit's crazy. Nowadays I can't sail around the world, so I'll take another shot. Be flying with the birds. I'd rather talk about the big bang theory. Then I know I'll see revenge of the nerds. I like that little play on the nerd shows and movies, you know what I mean? She I rather watch the Big Bang Theory because at least I know I'll, I'll be seeing the revenge of the nerds. I like that, man. I like that little play right there. Big Bang Theory, which is of course a show about a bunch of nerds, and then of course, you know, Revenge of the Nerds, a movie, a flick that was about a bunch of nerds, you know what I'm saying? I like that, man. Let's go. I'm tired of being scared. I'm tired of and I find it funny because, you know, as you guys know, I did a reaction to Wee Scheme's subpar rap battle uh, of YouTube where he had Napoleon Dynamite go up against, uh, fuck, I kept, I'm, I'm blanking on dude's name, Sheldon, I don't know why I'm blanking on his name for some reason, but anyway, yeah, uh, Napoleon Dynamite versus Sheldon, and then I just did a, a requested reaction from Angela Sh Sanchez. Again, shout out. Thank you for that. Appreciate that. Uh, where <laughs> Scheme had posted a short of him as uh, almost all the characters from that rap battle uh, performing his version of Last Christmas called Last Christmas. I gave you my, my thoughts and uh, the reaction is one of my most recent videos. So maybe after you watch this review, you can go check that out. I'd be greatly appreciated. I had a special guest host who decided it would be funny to have me be tied up while he was taking care of business over here. Oh well, yeah, I I ain't forgot about that. But it's all good. Made a deal, Tom. Yeah, you can do more reactions, but I ain't being tied up no more. <laughs> Asshole. Anyway. No work. We're tired of waking up and seeing everything is fucking worse. When will we stop the hokey pokey and turn ourselves around? Isn't that what it's all about? Oh, I like to play on the hokey pokey. When are we gonna stop playing the hokey pokey, turn ourselves around? I mean, isn't that what it's all about? I like that. Something's wrong when a bag of Doritos costs the same amount as a pint of tequila. Bag of Dorito costs the same amount as a pint of tequila. That is, yeah, that, that is insane. And good luck getting any Coke Zero. Twelve cans of that, seven ninety nine. Seven ninety nine, where you're at, Bruh, I wish it cost that much for us. I'm just saying. Tax, at least now there's toilet paper to wipe our ass, but baby formula is going pretty fast. Yeah, you notice that? We we now we now have uh. Toilet paper readily available after people realize how, how ridiculous they were when they re reacted to the whole news about, you know, the uh, the uh, COVID-19. Yeah, and yet, for some reason, we're running out of baby formula. Ain't that some shit. Ladies, it might be time to open up the tabs. Sit back, relax, and give your little one a blast. It's not my fault. What's going on in the world today? It's not my fault. y'all so that was my man jackson pierce with not my fault lyric video from his level-headed lp i'll go ahead definitely mash that like button because i did enjoy this one and as a matter of fact 
I also want to add this to the favorite artist mix. Because let me tell y'all something, man. I enjoyed the beat. You know what I'm saying? And I, I loved how my man flowed on this. Just like the, like the verses and the hook, the way they were they were I I intertwined with each other, the way they, they, they just flow into each other. So well done. So silky smooth. And I love my man's voice. You know what I'm saying? When he's rapping and when he's singing. Uh, speaking of singing, um, I know he does have uh, some new songs in the works. I won't, I won't get too much um, into those new songs, but uh, let's just say, man, I hope those, <laughs> those, those, those are dropping sometime soon, man, because I would love to, uh, you know, review those as well. The reason I'm not saying too much is because, you know, if I don't know what's going on with that. Hey, go subscribe to the man's channel. And if you're digging what he's doing over there, hey, consider becoming a channel member. And then you can see what exactly what I'm talking about for yourselves. You know what I'm saying? Right. So anyways, y'all, once again, Jackson Pierce, not my fault. Lyric video, level-headed LP. Make sure y'all keep your eyes and ears out for that. I know I will. I cannot wait for that, man. I'm excited. You know what I'm saying? Can't wait to see what else my man has coming down the pipeline. Uh, but yeah. If you guys are feeling this one, uh, you're new to my man Jackson Pierce, hey, go click on that video link, go show my man some love. Like I said, go subscribe. Consider becoming a channel member. You know what I mean? Go check out all the uh, exclusive channel member perks. You know what I'm saying? Trust me. My man's got some good stuff going on over there on this channel. And uh, if you're new to his channel and if you're coming from my channel, make sure you let him know your boy JJV done sent you. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. And of course, don't forget to check out all the other links in the description down below while you're at it that'll be greatly greatly appreciated if you're digging what i'm doing over here and you're new here like comment share subscribe ding the bell so you never miss an upload all those things will be greatly appreciated and again thank you everybody for all the love all the support you've been showing me very much appreciate each and every single one of y'all and i um, hope y'all are having a wonderful christmas season thus far and uh depending on when y'all watching this i hope y'all had a uh are having or had a wonderful christmas and uh, a happy new year. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. All right, y'all. Pretty much all I got to say. So, with all that being said, it is your boy, Jason JVs, and y'all take care. Have a blessed one. Catch y'all next one. Peace.